Hello and welcome to a new vlog. Today we are staying at the Grand Central Glasgow, which is in Glasgow city centre, so I thought I'd show you about. You only need to walk through the entrance to this hotel before you're in awe of the stunning foyer. This hotel is spectacular. It's an iconic landmark in Glasgow that originally opened in 1883. Designed by one of Glasgow's leading architects, Sir Rowan Anderson, who also designed Glasgow's National Portrait Gallery. This hotel has welcomed Winston Churchill and the Beatles. And this was the location of the first long distance television transmission by John Logie Baird in 1927. There's been many famous faces stared here including Nat King Cole, Charlie Chaplin and Bing Crosby. Over the years the hotel has had various owners and has been refurbed multiple times but it always retains its original charm. So we're staying in room 550 and I'm going to give you a tour of the room. So as you come in, you have the key card for the electricity, light switches and the temperature control. Now I think this might be a suite because it has a separate bedroom and living area and you come into what is a living area. So as you come in, you get around the corner, that's beautiful lamp, living room sofa area. with some complimentary water, massive sofa, which I think is also a bed, going with the size of it. Some lovely contemporary artwork, another matching lamp. And over here we have a place for your suitcase. Not much of a view, but I have specifically requested a room away from the main entrance. Um, last time we stayed here we were over the opposite side of the hotel which overlooks the central station uh, taxi rank at Gordon Street which midweek is great however mid um, Friday and Saturday for the weekends it's the main taxi rank for Glasgow so it's very busy people singing 3-4 in the morning and that's fine if that's the sort of atmosphere you're after when we get to our bed though you don't really want to be waking up with people singing at 4 in the morning so I specifically requested a room away from the main main roads. So that's why we don't have much of a view. But I'm not concerned about that because this room is stunning. So we have over here the living room as you come in, which I've showed you. And then from the living room, if I swivel back, there's like a wee in-shot area that has big TV, another lamp, another small window there and just a wee bin. So I'm back at the front door and if I turn, as I come in the front door and turn right, you go into this alcove and through into the bedroom. Now I'm going to apologise for the lighting in advance because there is no overhead lights. It's only the lights in the bedside cabinet and the lights on the wall, but this room is stunning. So we have a double bed with um, some bedside cabinets and some charging plug points. You can see there, this stunning bed. Again, not much of a view, but we're not overly concerned about that. This side of the bed has um, a set of chest of drawers. Again, with some more plug points. Nothing exciting in drawers. Lots of pillows on the bed. This um, large mirror, but if I turn back, there is also a massive mirror at the bottom of the bed and this kind of seat area here. Traditional um, heater and then I have a turn back, I have this massive storage unit which let's just have a wee look and we'll see what that is. Oh, so that has in it Laundry bag, an extra heater. That's the hair dryer. 
and an ironing board, iron down there. These are drawers. So these are just all drawers. And then this one is a safe. Well, it's not, it's a fridge. This one is a mini fridge. It's really difficult to see in here because of the lights. So if I open that top one, it has tea coffee making facilities and that drawer pulls out. So it's got kettle, um, tea, coffee, instant coffee, some biscuits, some mugs, um, bottle opener, always handy in these hotels. And if I just slide that back in, it has a lamp up here. So if I turn around to my left again, I have this bathroom, this uh, glass door that leads into which is clearly a refurbished bathroom. It's gorgeous. So we have the vanity, some towels, the vanity with these beautiful taps. Some drinking glasses. Some towels here. And then massive mirror again. Another light. So we have just the bathroom, toilet. Directly above, there's a bath mat, some tissues, and a note to say that you can get anything from reception. Beautiful big walk in shower. If I opens in the way. And that has shower and a rain shower head. They don't look new, but they look lovely nonetheless. Oh, look at those, the detail on that. Stunning! So this is in the main corridor. And this, you can see here, is raining outside, but that is the ceiling or roof of Central Station. And then the views over Glasgow. So these are just wee in shots that are not big enough to be part of rooms. There used to be sofas in them. It's very wet outside. I hope you liked our quick tour of the Grand Central Hotel in Glasgow, above Glasgow's Central train station. If you like the content and want to see more, please click the like button. Please click the subscribe button to follow along and why not follow us on Instagram. We'll see you next time. Bye!